So this is my review of this eBay garage door roll-up motor. Um, I think it was 115 bucks. I bought this six months ago. Uh, I finally just got time to install it. I had to make a couple brackets on the side of this building. Uh, this is one of those metal carport buildings. Insulated it for electric. Wasn't sure what to do about these doors, but I went with this. There wasn't too many reviews online uh, I couldn't find, so I figured I'm going to make one. Uh, besides making the bracket, I had to, uh, it didn't exactly fit inside the, the sprocket there. I had to grind out a little bit of the plastic, but it seems to uh, be pretty snug. I took like a, the two little forks that go in there, I took a bunch of rubber and I wrapped it around it so it's, you know, a little more cushion from the thing going back and forth. But, uh, what's this on my board? These directions are fucking terrible. <laughs> the little remote comes with two of these. So you can program any button to do the up or down. It's just the same button. You hit it once, it goes up. Um, Not too bad, it's pretty quiet. You don't have to uh, have it go all the way up. You can have it stop wherever you want it. I put it right about there, even though it has like another six inches. But it starts off really slow, um, and then it starts going, and then when it comes to a stop, it slows down again, which I really like. It has like a little light on it, and then run again. Not too bad for 120 bucks shipped. I mean, I just got it installed today, so I mean, seems pretty durable. See how long it lasts. This is me shutting the garage door from outside later on. Posted a video earlier. Um, Pretty quiet. You can almost barely hear it. Besides the fact that it's a metal door, but. <laughs> 